So hi guys, today I'm going to be showing you how to actually get this app, uh, record my screen, um, and how to use it. So credits is just giving who did what in their Twitter. Settings, stereo, mono, both work. Sample rate, 44, 1000 hertz is perfectly good for me. Um, record audio is whether it's recording or talking or not. Um, video orientation is portrait, landscape, um, if you're on the iPad, portrait actually means landscape, and landscape means portrait. If you're on the iPhone, it's normal. If you're on the iPad, have it on half for video size. If you're on an iPhone, have it on native or iTouch. So, yeah, once you stop recording, actually let it keep um, stay on the app and let the record button become green so you know that the audio and video files have merged. Let's go to this. So how you get it is actually this mu mu four ios dot weebly dot com slash downloads html dot html. I'll be putting this in the description. This link. So what you do is you scroll down to record screen and record my screen. Record my screen is a very good one, and I would recommend getting it. It's better than record screen. Now you can only have one of these apps. So if you really like, for example, Nescaline. You can't get record my screen unless you delete Nescaline. So if I actually dis if I actually install record screen, then record my screen automatically uninstalls. So what you just do is click install and let it install. You'll get this app. And yeah. Thanks. Bye YouTube.